Hi Pisces, welcome to your mid-month reading. As always, keep in mind that this is only a general reading. Always check what it feels right and with what does resonate within your own life experiences during this time. If you would like to have a personal reading with me, please contact me through the email I put in the description box below. For the month of September, as usual, I have a special sales offer available and for this month it's inspired in the current Virgo season we are on. And if you would like to know more details about it, just check in the description uh, box or email me with your questions. If you would like to donate and support my channel, you can also do that by following the PayPal link, which is also down below. So some of you Pisces feel like throughout this mid-September period, you might really be looking for answers, trying to clarify your mind, trying to find alternative ways here to meet goals that along the way have also suffered some level of transformation like there's goals and aspirations that some of you are carrying as being this very 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 precious it's almost like a dream box right and you're holding this dream box dreams visions you know expectations places you want to go adventures you want to have um jobs you would like to have opportunities in life that you would like to have it's, it's like you're gathering all of this ideals in your high, highest hopes into the same space and you're holding this for some time and as some of you pisces have been walking on your journey it feels like some of those ideals and hopes have been changing have been somehow altered from what initially you thought you wanted for some of you there's a change of what you thought you wanted out of life what you thought you wanted out of love what you thought you wanted um in your career some of you are facing this very sense of like a dramatic point in your life because you're shedding an old identification here and shedding this old way of being, thinking, relating here. Um, for some of you, Pisces costs you something. It's like you really needed to leave behind or made a certain sacrifice to now becoming, you know, in this um, version of yourself that is different from a previous one, but that still holds itself as being... Um, you and sometimes you know when you're moving through those transitions we can lo we can lose reference to who we are we can lose reference to our core we can lose reference of what we're supposed to be um you know how we're supposed to talk how we're supposed to relate because the previous format is dead it's not working anymore so you're, it's almost like you're in a phase of full-on adaptation to a lot of things at the same time. And this can be causing you some stress during mid-September because you want to just be at peace. You want the process perhaps to be painless, to be smooth. And there are some rough edges here for some of you Pisces it's like you're almost there in a point of integration so that's the good news is that no longer uh, than December this this process will be done so it might take up until December time and I know this is for mid mid September but it might take until the end of the year for for you to really feel at whole whole at peace connected right plugged back into your center into your core where you feel like yourself where you feel strong where you feel you know aware of what you're doing where you're heading what what are the best choices the choices that align with your true pur purpose and what are not so there's also a feeling here of give it time give time to the universe here to reveal itself to you 
to the magic to be revealed to you. It's almost like some of you Pisces could be feeling throughout this time that you're not doing enough. You don't know where to go, where to turn, and you keep feeling like the more you look out for direction, you know, the more confused you get. Those might be signs that this is a time, the new vision card, it's the card of the hangman. This is a time to be um, in stillness. Things are not moving for a reason. Things are not happening for a reason. It's a time to recoil information elsewhere, which is from your spiritual, um, this, the relationship you have with your spiritual being. The, the the awareness of what your spiritual truth is um your connection with the divine is sharpening your senses awakening your senses so you can receive downloads of information that you're not going to find anywhere else so for those of you pisces that that are familiar with some you know, spiritual practices or uh, healing uh, methods. Um, this is a great time to invest on that uh, energy um, because it's going to, it's almost like um, it's going to recharge you. It's going to protect you is going to slowly bring that peace and silence you desire to have in your life um, much faster than without like this again divine occult right behind the veil assistance there's a feeling here of prayer meditation or any kind again of practice that has an intention to connect you with your higher self, to connect you with God, to connect you with the universe, to connect you with things of high above. Those things are so um, positively at your reach during mid-September. And what, you know, the intention of this time is, is to, it's almost like for some of you Pisces, there's a feeling here of the spiritual realm really wanting to take you and, and protect you during this time, right? So if you are trying to resist this embrace of spiritual love, um, some of you Pisces could be hurting more, could be struggling more, could be, again, just not really knowing what you're doing because you're missing on that connection that makes things in the most you know in the most difficult of times the times where things seem most um scary you know we turn to faith because it's the only thing we're left with when we understand how limited right our real power is and our plane the material plane realm let's put it that way really is so it's a time of ascension to find integration unity wholeness in your being for some of you uh there can be a sense of a discussion that initiates this process so you can get yourself into a fight that triggers um all this need for self-discovery or retreat um, you could get, get yourself into a, a fight or into um, a problem that, again, sets this spiritual um, calling on place. And you keep being called and called. It's almost like really, you know, being called to ascend, called to another... Um, to another realm to see something that in this one you can't see especially the more attached you are to the old to your old physical vessel so to the old man or woman you have been this is basically a, there's an intention here of enlightenment right and so 
a rebirth that occurs through it. Uh, there's also some Pisces that just might be, you know, something here about confessing scenes to be free. So again, there's that feeling of needing to find healing. And uh, for some Pisces, it could be that your way of finding it is also by uh, confess, uh, confessing here truths, confessing um sins again things that you feel ashamed of guilty of uh clearing regrets and really putting here in one side or the other the energy of forgiveness right circulating to help you again everything on that level is going to benefit you even if you think you're being a fool or taking an advantage right now in the end you will see how that forgiveness how that love, how that uh, openness to even declare or confess things that are hard for you to admit will pay off in the end. There's going to be a sense of, um, it's almost like a refund. It's been, something has been taken out of you that hurts. There's a feeling of hurt here that then you will be later refunded and in a big way. So I hope you have a great mid-month. Thank you so much for all of you that have been liking, sharing, subscribing, commenting, and donating to my channel. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Hopefully we'll see each other soon.